Thank you, Shashi, and for all you're doing. And to all of you, uh, my favorite verse, Omagana timiranda syagadangana salakaya chakshurun militam genetasmai Sri Gurave namaha. You were so fortunate. You received this vidya in your breast milk, in the arms of your mother and grandmother and grandfather. We all, I believe, met each other first with the sages of Naima Sharanya 5,000 years ago when Veda Vyas was writing the Veda down. And we all took vows that we would keep coming back to sustain this great body of knowledge for the enlightenment of all. So it's an honor to be here with you, Koti Dandavats. Those of us who have come from the outside have come with a particular purpose in the same way that those of you who have come from the inside have. It is that together we are going to stand as the beacon of this universal truth, which is true for everyone at all times. And we test it constantly to make sure the signal is clear and bright. This is about education, this conference. The Greek word for education is edukari. Edukari means to bring forth from within. This isn't happening anymore. We are now dumping knowledge on top of people. In Sanskrit, the word is adhikari. This came first. It is qualification. But we say that everyone is qualified in one regard. They are the atma. They are immortal. They are divine. And so all education is leading us back to our true nature. We all took a vow to stand for this in some way. We are all each other's gurus. We are all carriers for some important part of this. What really convinced me is this attitude, that no one is a know-it-all. Everyone is a carrier of some small part. Madhava Seva, Manushya Seva. So thank you again for being my gurus and for assembling together in this sacred way. I can only say, Yad Yad Acharati Shreshtas Tad Ebe Taro Janaha Sayat Pramanam Kurute Lokas Tad Anuvartite. Thank you.